Hi, my name is Marissa Morris, and I'm here to share a exercise with you that I call the snow globe. I'm not going to share anything really about it with you. After you do the exercise, then I'll pretty much take you through what it is, how it works, what you're basically doing by doing this exercise. But if you found the site, I think that you found it for a reason. And um, why don't we get started? So. What this exercise is going to do is you're going to use visualization. You're going to use your imagination basically. So I want you to kind of get into a state of being a little kid again. Okay. So I want you to get comfortable, find a place to get comfortable right now. Uh, if you've got s crying kids or screaming kids around, um, occupy them for maybe about a minute, minute or two. We're going to do a really fast express mom version. I only have a couple seconds type of exercise for you right now. So as soon as you've found a comfortable spot, maybe you can go hide in the bathroom. I want you to go ahead and using your imagination, I want you to imagine that you're a snow globe. So in your mind say, I am a snow globe. As soon as you do that, you're going to close your eyes. And then just imagine, imagine that you, your physical body is the statue in the center of a snow globe. There's water and there's snowflakes swirling around you or maybe some are sitting at the bottom of the snow globe, just resting at the bottom. And then the glass around the snow globe. It may be fairly close, it may be really far. It doesn't matter where it is. So what you're gonna do is just tune into what the statue feels like using your imagination. What does the statue feel like? Is it hot? Is it cold? Is it slimy? Is it dry? What color is it? What does it smell like? Taste like? Does it have a sound? Again, you're just using your imagination. And then bringing your awareness out to the water, the snowflakes. What color are your snowflakes? What color is the water? Is it thick and goopy? Is it thin and clean? Again, it doesn't matter what you're feeling or seeing or sensing. So just feel what you feel and that's all. Now take your awareness out to the glass. Is the glass clean? Is it dirty? Is it foggy? Does it have fingerprints on it? Are there little cracks in your snow globe? Is there water leaking out or air getting in? Just sense and sense what the glass feels like, it looks like. Now that you've done that, what you're going to do is you're going to bring your attention to a ball of light in the statue or your physical body below the heart and above the solar plexus. That's going to be right between the bottom of your ribs on the front side of you. <clears throat> I want you to bring your awareness from wherever it is into that area. You can imagine that that area is a big bubble big bright bubble and inside of it you're inside of it now you're in this big bubble what does that feel like and then from above just imagine that way from above way up straight up above you a laser beam of light shooting down 
into the center of the top of your snow globe, down through the top of the statue, the body, and into this bubble of light that you have right below your heart. As this laser, or some may see it as liquid light, as this fills up this bubble with you in it, what you can do is using your breath, breathe in. And as you breathe in, your bubble expands with all the light that's coming in from above. And as you breathe out, releasing anything that does not serve you, your bubble continues to expand and anything it touches turns any snowflakes that are not white into white, clean snowflakes. Any water that's sludgy or dirty immediately, instantly, is clear and clean. So just sit for about 20, 30 more seconds breathing in. Breathing out, allowing this bubble to expand out until it's about five feet above your head, five feet below your feet, five feet out to each side, in front and behind you. Now what you can do is just feel to feel what your snowflakes feel like feel to feel what your statue feels like. Feel or see or sense what the water feels like. And the last thing you can do is just now say protection. And you'll see a gold stream of almost like liquid paint coming down from above going to pour down over your snow globe and as it fills your snow globe it's going to seal any cracks it's going to clean off any fingerprints any dirt any distortions any fog and completely surround you and with that you will have just done the snow globe go to our next video and I'll explain to you what you did but just wanted to run you through that real quick. I hope that you feel a little bit better and watch the next video and figure out what it is that you just did. All right, thank you.